Hey everybody, Chris Farad here. Welcome back to XCOM Enemy Unknown. Uh, just a reminder, head over to graylinesgaming.com, check out the forums that we set up there, and read some of the journals that people have been posting. They're pretty detailed, pretty, uh, pretty great actually. I'm constantly impressed. I'm not, I don't post anything on there, I want that solely for you guys, but uh, I read them all and they're, <laughs> they're pretty awesome. Uh, so here we are, we're gonna get a satellite, uh, so let's just get that. Commander, our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. Now we've got two options here. We could go to Egypt or we could go to uh, any of these two places over here. Obviously South Africa, but it's got only one panic level. So I think I'm going to go to... I could go to Egypt, but I really want to work towards getting future combat bonus to make... I think it's certain things are cheaper. I'm not sure exactly what. Uh, we also have Argentina here, but we do have the We Have Ways bonus already. So I'm not in a big fuss to get Argentina. Um... I'm gonna go to Japan, we get more money, and it takes us one step closer to finishing uh, future combat, and hopefully that works out for us. Satellite launched. There we go. Uh, the other thing somebody suggested is buying a scope for my heavy, and I actually kind of like that idea. Because the heavies do tend to miss a lot, but when they hit, it's like, it's heavy, right? So, I mean, yeah, it makes sense. So let's do that. Now we have one, and I'm also I'm gonna do the alien base assault sometime during the month. But I'm gonna scan and see if we can get anything to happen before then. Uh, kind of farm up our our um, resources a bit more. Oh, there we go. Commander, we've picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. Okay, so this is actually really good because it's taking us to Egypt, which is going to reduce the uh, the panic. It's a very difficult mission, which is making me nervous a bit, but uh, I think that's a no-brainer to go to Egypt compared to India. Even though we would get a new heavy captain. Oh, that is really tempting, but we gotta go here. We gotta go to Egypt. So, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take a, a lower rank out. So, Home Slice, you came out last time. Let's take out Cadrados. We need the assault in there anyways. So, let's change it up a bit. Oops. Get the scatter laser going, tear pace armor, pistol, and vest, like that. You also gotta change this because you're now a squatty. And we need to change your armor. Something awesome. How about a little bit of, how about a little bit of that? That looks pretty cool. Okay, great. Kedratos is dressed, everyone else is good. We're just going to change from the nanofiber to the scope. And we've got rep cam with a med kit and an arc thrower. We also have Agent Foster, or Agent, <laughs> Sergeant Foster with uh, the med kits. And everybody is looking pretty good right now. Like, we have a good, good team. Everyone's got lasers. We're having a super time. Strike oh, one. Prepare for landing. There's a tsunami happening or some type of weird tornado action, like two of them. That's got to be some bad weather up there. We're dropping you just inside the Egyptian border. Okay, We've picked so up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Let's do that. We're playing on the train map, which is less than desirable in Egypt. Copy that, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage hostile targets. Watch your backs out there, people. So really what we want to do is we want to get our snipers in a position where they can see kind of this whole area, see all the way down here. This backside I'm not super concerned about, but uh, that's kind of the initial game plan is to get our snipers into position. So let's take a look. Cadrados, part of being the rookie, is getting out there, seeing what's up. That's actually a really, really good sign. 
We're gonna put Grelite all the way over here in this corner. And then eventually probably take Kadratos' spot. Let's move our heavy up here. Oh! Hello! Oh, he's coming in. I dare ya. So... Do we want... I think I'm gonna pull him back. Get everybody else into position. So that if this guy comes closer, this disc, which he probably will, then at least we have a chance to take him down. But I can't get everyone into good positions to fire it uh, right off the bat, so... Have to make that decision. I'm gonna go up here into half, co into half cover because we do have the low profile, which puts us in full cover anyways, so... Huge benefit. Everyone on Overwatch. Oh, she's coming around this side. Don't like that. Repcam, nice job. This is not going to be good on Repcam. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, we just got really lucky. And I think that drone's healing. That's oh, in there. Oh. It's not carrying a weapon like the others. What could it be doing? Yeah, what is it doing? Anybody? Oh, that's like the... He like crushes us or something, I think. Oh, he's running far away, which is great. Okay, uh, this cyber disc thing is like our number one priority right now. We're gonna get back. We're gonna get back far. I think everything's out of sight there now. I don't I don't see anything, so even if we go here. Oh yeah, of course. <laughs> I can maybe try to take out the drone. 50%. A one in two chance of killing this guy. We're going for it. Not yet. <laughs> so much for that scope. So much for that snow. We'll finish him off, though. Don't you worry. Loco, you want it, don't you? There you go. Nice shot. Nice shot. Okay, we're gonna go Overwatch here. Overwatch with Foster as well. I think what I'm gonna do is bring Kedratos over. Oh no, if I put Kedratos there, he's in sight. Let's go Overwatch. And we're gonna Overwatch Grelite as well. This could be interesting. Depending on how far this disc comes. Oh, nice! I'm actually happy he went down. We gotta get our rookie off of that shotgun on Overwatch. My mistake. Poor instructions. Heads down. Oh, someone's going down. Oh no. Oh crap. Oh no. Oh no. We're getting crushed right now. You guys told me don't keep them together. I know. What is that guy doing? Okay, this big bastard here, he needs to die. That needs to happen like ASAP. So, heavy. Can you make this happen? You're gonna get two shots on him. Actually, you may not have. Oh my god. Critical, baby. Let's get critical. Critical. Nice! Heavy, you were the man. Okay. Oh, he's coming at us. What the hell? Okay, panic. That's actually a good place for you to panic, too. 
Uh, now, we want to get into at least some cover here before taking on this guy. So I'm going to fall back and play it a little bit safer. Hopefully give us a chance to heal up. Bit. I don't want to go way over there. Eee, this is not great. Let's actually... Let's get into healing mode right now. We have to pull back here. Relic doesn't have a shot, but if that guy comes closer, he's gonna have a shot. Loco, pistol, everybody else is Overwatch. You on your pistol now, Kadratos. Oh, we're wasting it on this little drone. Oh well. <laughs> so good. We've got some noise. Here we go. Where's he going? What the hell? Very indecisive, that guy. Still panicked. Interesting. Okay, we're gonna pull back and do some more healing. Hedratos, okay, you're gonna be next, don't worry. Local back up. We could probably move Grelite into this position, but I would like to have at least one sniper on Overwatch. Still panicked. Let's see if Gypsy can spot him. No, he can't. Go Overwatch. Okay, Thin Man, I dare ya. What the hell is this? Oh my god! <laughs> you are gonna be in the hospital, I can tell you that much. That is for sure. 1%, okay, 65% chance to hit. I think that's a pretty good chance. But I don't wanna leave her out there because Ah, uh, that, that's better. See, so yeah, yeah, I'm a little bit nervous. I probably should have just healed. Because if I leave her here, if I take the shot, I'm not going to be able to get a kill. And someone's coming at me. 65% is just not a great percentage uh, for being left in the open. So I'm, unfortunately, I'm going to pull back. We're gonna have our two snipers now on Overwatch. Our heavy as well. Ooh, our heavy needs to reload. Okay, let's put you back here and then reload you. Loco, Overwatch. Heal up our assault. Then we can bring our assault over. There we go. I think we're in pretty decent positions here. Oh, that guy's screwed. <laughs> Who's gonna get him? Loco got it. And a promotion. That's what I like to see. That guy is now poisoned because he ran through the shit cloud. Okay, I'm gonna poke my head out here with rep cam. See if we can spot anything. We can. 
And what I'm gonna do is use our snipers. Oh, you can't, you don't have SWAT tech for that thing, isn't it? That's not great. Okay, pull back again. Let's get Foster in there. Nothing. Okay. Everybody overwatch. I'll actually put our heavy up top here. I think that may give us a little bit of a height advantage. And Grelite should reload, but we need to take these guys down, so we're gonna go for it if they come out. Which they probably will. There we go. Somebody take him. Nice. I don't know who got him there. There you go. Knock him in the head a couple times. Or just scare him a bit. That'll also work. <laughs> okay. Who's got eyes on this beast? Oh. Oh. See? Yeah, that's what happens. That's what happens. Okay, you need to heal yourself. Enjoy that. I think what I'm going to do is take Kadratos out of view. So that nobody has sight, and then that'll force him to move. See, I'm not sure. I think these boxes might just be blocking all of our view from Daniel. But if somebody comes in this area, we should have a shot, I think. So we're gonna go overwatch with Loco, and we're gonna reload Grelite. There we go. Can we do it? Oh, so close! Kadratos, come on! Come on! Oh, this is duck, duck. Ah! Oh my, well, no doubt you panicked. There's monsters right in your face. <laughs> oh, this is terrible. We're getting crushed right now. Okay, Loco, can't do that. Kadratos, you, this is all you. You're not gonna do it. Oh my god. I don't think I've ever seen a miss that bad. No offense, Pedrados. That's pretty terrible. Daniel, take him down. Okay. Is everyone shit together? Kind of. <laughs> You're gonna heal again. We're gonna have everybody in the hospital. Our next mission's gonna be damn near impossible. Okay, we need to move Grelite up now. We're gonna reload Loco. We're gonna reload our Heavy. And Grelite's the only one with the pistol and watch. But they should be far enough away to do any serious damage. There we go. Let's start moving in here. Okay. Head in beside this box here. That's kind of a cool little cubby hole, actually. Uh oh. Well, there goes that cover. Yeah, I don't like that anymore. Let's see, though, if we can't. Oh, we don't have squad sight there either. Or with Grelite. Because of that thing in the middle, that's taking up a lot of our, our view. This thing's on full health still. We could just suppress and then try to move into better position. I think that's probably what we'll do, actually. So, Grelite, let's move you over here. Yeah. 
There we go. Now you'll have sight at least. We're going to move Daniel as well. There we go. Loco, I think, probably on the other side of Relay would be great. But maybe we'll move you up here. I just don't think that's quite as safe yet. Kadratos, let's, uh, let's move you and we'll reload you. So, I'm going to put some heat on this guy with my heavy. Oh, it's only 30%. Let's save it. And then we'll suppress. There you go. I'm actually going to pop the smoke here, too. Just in case, everybody. Let's put it... Right there. Train, though. Now we're going to take... Uh, you know what? I think we can shoot at him with Grelite here pretty confidently. Where can I put Repcam, though? Let's put you over here. Take a break. 26%, that is terrible. Okay, we're gonna take this shot. We're gonna go headshot, see what happens. Not gonna get the kill, or are we gonna hit him? Ooh, we're not. Okay, double tap. All right, let's go for it again. Too worried about that intimidate way back here. Should I be? <laughs> I still want to stay in this cloud of smoke for sure. If I move in here, I'm gonna do that. Let's see if we can't damage this. Oh, that was my second move. Not good. Commander's making some crucial mistakes here. And our sniper is basically out of commission up here. I could fire a rocket. 30%, that's just so low. That's just Overwatch. This guy in the train is probably going to get hit. Ooh. Okay, that makes me happy. He's going. There we go. Man down. Sleep, little one. Okay, now we're going to press up a bit. And we're going to get Loco into the action a bit more, I hope. I'd like to actually get him up here. Let's just put him there. Magic Man Tim Foster on the green thing. And Repcam. Let's get you... Actually, we can maybe flank with you and see what's going on out here. Okay, everybody overwatch. We're gonna reload rep cam. 
I think we're in a pretty good position. We're definitely going to be hospitalized after this, but uh, I think, I think everything's going to be okay. How's, uh, yeah, we should probably, we should probably just reload. We could move our heavy in, but I would rather take a look with Tim. See what exactly we can find. Nothing. Okay. I don't have any good, decent cover here except for that green thing. So we're gonna go there. I'm gonna continue down this path with rep cam. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Okay, now I need to be a bit worried because Kedratos is heavily flanked. And I don't have a good spot to run to. I guess right here we'll have to do. And Repcam, you are also on the run. If somebody comes out this side though, I'm gonna get flanked I think. This is a tough call. I think what I'm gonna do is just hide behind these barrels. There we go. Okay, everybody on Overwatch. Our sniper rifle, or our, our uh, sniper, I should say, is possibly flanked, but I'm hoping that anything that runs out here, we can kill first. And we have Corellian on the other side now, which isn't great. Ooh, that looked like a hit. I was distracted by the hairdo, though. Blood Call. I'm not exactly sure what Blood Call does, but I think it makes them uh, quite a bit stronger. So, here we are again, defending. Pretty used to that. <laughs> okay, we're in good positions. Magic Man Tim Foster, I'm okay with you being up there, except that you definitely need some ammo. So I'm gonna pull you back. Reload you. Daniel, I'm gonna need you to crush something here real hard. Relite. I should actually have a sniper right there where he is, but. Let's. I think, like, I have a feeling they're gonna come down this way, so it's probably best to have a sniper over here. But what I'm gonna do is actually, I'm gonna get some height advantage. Even though he's flanked, he's really far back. I think we're in a good position there. And if they don't come at us, then... Okay, here we go. I was going to say, if they don't come at us, we'll go at them. Now they are running down that way. Of course. <laughs> So where can we put our heavy? That over there is a little bit scary. It's a little far. I think... Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm actually just gonna keep you where you are. Everybody on Overwatch. And then if we don't have any action here, move in. Oh, sounds like action. Does not look like action. Okay, let's come up here. We're gonna move Relate up on these boxes now. Let's get Tim to poke his head in. There we go, where's that at? Uh-huh, uh-huh. 
Do our snipers have a shot on that with squad sight? I don't think so. Oh, we do. But I can't fire that weapon right now. Oh, terrible. But that guy's going to have to move. Like, he's in the open. So I'm going to go at him here. There we go. Everybody else, just overwatch. Let's actually move you up. Provide some additional fire, if necessary. Same with Pedrados. Oh, there's a guy right there. That is not good. Oh, head down. Oh, Foster. Oh. I did not know he was there. Oh, no. Not good. Not good at all. Okay. Relic, can you take him down, do you think? What are the odds? Yep, you can. Okay. I'm gonna put Loco up on this marker as well. Aside from that initial grenade, uh, we haven't had a lot of hits, but this has definitely been one of our more troubling scenarios to date. Oh no! Another flank! Come on. This is, this is bad news bears right here. Oh! I'm just holding my breath. Nothing we can do. Okay. There is a guy over here. I think he's in this train. We need to, like, not be where we are right now. Kedratos, I would love to keep you there, but it's way too dangerous. I'm moving you out. Everyone else, we're okay, and we can crush here. Finish him. Great work. Heavy, we're gonna move because you're gonna be just left in the open here. Oh, I don't think I switched Grelly to the sniper. Oh, we got lucky there. Oh, he was on snipes. Okay. So let's push out, see if we can get eyes here. Oh yeah. Okay, we're going on this. Ooh! Very close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have your little spaz attack there. Not worried. Edrados, I know you've been waiting for it. It's your turn. We're gonna run and gun. We're gonna blow this guy away. Do you understand? Proceed to eliminate. Only a 92%? What if? <laughs> Epic. Look at the crows. Excellent work. All objectives complete. Ooh. Okay, so we lost one, unfortunately. Oh, Timmy. I feel bad, brother. We'll give you a proper send-off to the memorial. You've been with us for a while. That's part of battle, I guess. Which means we're going to have to hire more rookies. Which I'm okay with, and I'm sure some of you are too. Okay. Kadratos is now a corporal. That's fantastic. So you've got aggression or tactical sense. 
And I think that tactical sense is the way to go, but I'm actually going to change this over to aggression because if we can get a plus 30% critical chance with the inc increased chance that we already have on the scatter laser, that could be pretty gnarly. So we're going to try that this time. Congratulations, Kedratos. Uh, Daniel, two grenades or danger zone. Increased area of effect on suppression and all rock attacks by two tiles. Absolutely. Very cool. And Loco has been promoted in the zone or double tap. So Grelite has double tap. Okay, which is great because it allows both actions to be used for standard shot, headshot, or disabling shot, providing no moves were made. So you can basically shoot twice, which is cool. Uh, in the zone, if you kill an enemy that's flanked or not in cover, then the sniper rifle does not cost an action. So if you have guys in cover for or not in cover for whatever reason, then you can kind of pick them off, which is pretty cool. But I think double tap is just a lot more flexible because not too often do you have people that aren't flanked or uh, are not in cover. So I'm going to go with double tap again. And look at our wounds. So it's actually not too bad. Uh, two days and then four days, four days, which hopefully we can just bypass on our next spin. So we got a bunch of stuff. Fantastic. Panic decreased in Asia. Look how much panic decreased in Egypt, though. That is crucial. We will be in touch, Commander. Here's the situation room now. So panic has increased over here. All of it. But it has decreased here, so... I guess that's part of the battle. We are going to get a satellite up in India very soon, though, so I'm happy about that. Before we go... Commander, we're in desperate need of additional troops. I know. If we don't start recruiting new soldiers through the barracks soon, we're not going to win this fight. I know, he's right. And we will be hiring new soldiers very soon. Uh, so, before we go to the memorial, I just want to say thank you guys for all of the support uh, on these videos. I appreciate that very, very much. And if you guys have any tips, any advice that you think we should be doing right now, I've got 200 bucks. Uh, we've got what's happening here. A satellite going live in Japan. We're going to have a satellite in 10 days. We've got 21 days till the council report. When do you think I should assault the alien base? What do you think I should buy? I'm hoping to get to laser or light plasma rifles in six days. A lot of things happening. So let's go to the memorial. Where is he? Tim Foster. Five kills, five missions. Died on July 11, 2015. Sad, sad day on Operation Empty Stallion. There's nothing empty about your performance except for your ultimate demise. Thanks guys for watching. We'll talk to you soon.